It's your boy, Big Kelv, repping at Seven Day Genetics, and y'all know how I do it. I work out seven days. Seven days. Now, back to my segment that I call The Real Truth, in which I talk about things that are important to me. Sometimes good, sometimes bad, always informative. I just hope you get something out of it. And today, what I want to talk about is how we need to stop going through life feeling manipulated. And you might ask yourself, you know, what do I mean by this? Well, first and foremost, in your work situation, if you feel like you're putting out a lot of effort to do what the job entails and you're going above and beyond, but nobody cares, like people expect a lot from you, but you're not getting a lot in return. Matter of fact, you're not even getting appreciate that. I thank you. Oh, I, I, I see that you went above and beyond. You're great. You gotta stop that type of shit. Because if you feel like you're manipulated, what'll end up happening is you'll, you'll it'll hit your self-esteem pretty hard. You'll start feeling like you're of no value. The minute you start feeling that way, it's time to go. It's time to leave that job because it's doing nothing but sucking the life out of you. And do you really want to work somewhere that's sucking the life out of you? In your relationships, if you feel like you're being manipulated, like the person that you're in a relationship is with you for a reason other than the fact that they love you, whether it be money, and fellas, I'm sure a lot of you have dealt with that, and ladies, some of you have, I'm pretty certain also that the person you're with is financially not very sound, but it seems like they're with you just for the monetary aspect of things. Or they're always asking you for money or I'll give it back to you. Let me tell you something. Me, I'm in a relationship with a woman. It don't matter how much she makes. I'm not going to ask her for money. It's just not my MO. I, I can't do it. It's not because I'm, I'm a man. and men should, No, 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 no. In the end, no one should really be asking the other person for money. I mean, yeah, you pay your bills and things like that. But hey, can I, can I get? No, 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 no. That's just not the situation. I feel like both people in the relationship should work and they should have their own money. And when they want to do things, they don't have to ask what the other person thinks because they made their own damn money. I'm just saying, if you're in a relationship and you feel like the other person is manipulating you or ladies, I'm sure a number of you have felt this. You're in a relationship with a guy. He says you're in a relationship. In the end, you start to believe that it's just about sex. So you're being manipulated. He's pretending to love or care about you just to get the sex when he wants it. Yeah, that's being manipulated and you better step your shit up. If that's the situation, you know it's not going anywhere and it's just about sex, walk away. Unless you know what it is and he's honest and you're honest and you both enjoy the sex and that's that's good enough, then that's great. But as he's lying to you, telling he loves you and you just, you know deep down inside he doesn't, it's time to step off. And fellas, I'm sure some of you are going through that same thing. You're with a woman who doesn't necessarily want to be with you, but she loves the sex. You're being manipulated. It's time to move on. There are a number of situations in life in which people are manipulated in, and they need to learn to walk away from those situations because they do nothing but drain you and also make a tremendous hit to your self-esteem. And you know what? Man, with all the bullshit in our worlds, that's the thing we don't need. And the fuck up. Now, the reason I bring this up is because I can't even pinpoint. Well, I can pinpoint, but I have so many people around me that are like this, who are manipulating in one way or another. And all they do is stress and and they complain and all of them. I just want to say, go up to them and because I'm so understanding and slap the shit out of them and tell them, fuck out of here. Get a situation in life that makes you happy, whether it's your relationship, uh, with your boyfriend, girlfriend, husband, wife, um, your family, with your job, no matter what it might be, it needs to be a situation that's conducive to your sanity, your mental well-being, and if not, walk the fuck away. But anyways, it's your boy, Big Kel. If you like what you heard, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you're not the type to subscribe, that's cool too. Just watch my damn videos and make sure you sign in when you do. Also, if you have an idea for an upcoming video,
go ahead and post in the comments below. And if it's something that hits me here like it hits you, well, I'll make a video about it. But if not, then I won't. And I hope you don't get butt hurt because I won't give a shit. And that's not because I have anything personal against you. But I think you guys already know if you've been watching these videos, I'm not going to do a thing unless I'm passionate about it. But anyways, it's your boy, Big Kelf. And as usual, I'll see you all tomorrow. Peace.